hey guys so in today's video i'm going to show you how to save password on iphone in ios 17. so with latest update of ios 17 apple apps have increased or released some new feature into their password manager so i'm going to show you how to save password and manage it in this video so the first thing you need to do is open your settings and you need to scroll down to password so by default for the password that i used to create account or log into a website is going to save to your password manager on your iphone but in some cases it's not going to save so i don't know why sometimes it's not it is not saving i'm going to show you how to save it manually so if you want to save it manually head over to password in your settings and you need to enter your your face id or your passcode after that click on this plus icon at the top right corner and you need to select new password once you select new password you need to enter the title of the password so you can just write anything in the title and you need to enter the website's name once you enter the website's name you need to enter your username on the app and you need to enter your password right here so let me just enter test and everything so i'm going to enter test.com also I'm going to enter test right here. So you don't even need to write anything in this place because it's going to use the website name for this place. And for the icon, it is the website icon that's going to appear right here if the website has an icon. So once you are done, you can now click on done at the top right corner and it's, and it's going to take you to the settings of the password. So you're going to see the option to delete it. And you're going to see this option to set up verification code. So this verification code is just like Google Authenticator. So you need to enable it in the website and you need to link it first. So just like using Google verification code, I don't know why they bring it to the settings without creating another app for it, but that's just Apple doing their things. So you are going to see easily guess the passcode. So they are going to tell you if the security of the passcode is strong or weak. So if the security passcode is weak, you can just head over to the website they are going to take you to the website and you'll be able to change the password to a more stronger password. So you are going to see the option to add notes also and you can edit it. So if your iPhone did not automatically save your passcode, you can just come over here and save it individually. So let's say you want to log into the website and you want to check your username and passcode. Just head over to your passwords on your iPhone and you need to search for it. So let me search for test. You can you see this is the one I created. So click on passcode and it's going to display it. So you can now select copy to copy the passcode. You can also click on the username to copy it. Very easy. So if you want to edit anything in this place, you are going to see edit at the top right corner. And you can share the passcode also. Let me show you how to edit it first. So once you edit it, you can now edit the website name. You can edit the notes. You can edit the username and all of that. So if you want to share this passcode, also click on this upload right here and you'll be able to share the passcode so it is very easy just try this out and you'll be able to do that all of that if you found this video helpful smash the like button and subscribe to my channel for more amazing videos like this thanks for watching